Good afternoon and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to yet another rousing episode of Tetris Effect Connected. As promised, my name is Allison Cruz, and truth be told, although I am a man of my word, I am no more rested than I was at the end of the last part. Which, if you guys happen to see the atrocity of a performance, then uh, I apologize, but I do intend on making it up here in the Jeweled Veil. Right, so as one would expect on a stage called Jeweled Veil, we find ourselves surrounded by jewels in a veil-like fashion. And of all things that this imagery evokes in my mind, it's the Final Fantasy games for PlayStation, which is kind of insane because like you see this and does your mind go to PlayStation or Final Fantasy at any point? Unlikely. But, uh, yeah, I was actually considering doing one of those games at some point on the channel. There's just been a lot of other stuff going on and coming out. And the fact that people probably would rather see me play a different one than the one I would record. Which, I guess, if you're curious, would be Final Fantasy IX, of all things. I don't know, man. That one just kind of, like, hit me a little differently, you know? So, I'm a, I'm a very big fan of that one. And uh, if I did do one game from that era, it would be that or Tactics. <laughs> so, it's a fun time. But uh, those games are known to be pretty, pretty long. And uh, I'm trying to... <laughs> sort of stray away from that mostly because uh well i've been doing a lot of them on the channel lately i think ghost of tsushima comes out to 105 episodes which is great and also uh legends arceus which is kind of funny i think this series will have already started before that one ends maybe but all in all it turned out to be uh 48 main episodes and the 48th part, which is the finale, turned out to be 48 minutes and 48 seconds. Completely unintentional. Well, of course, YouTube, oh, come on, please give me the thing. Please give me, please give me the line. Uh, okay, this is dumb. There we go. Okay, we saved it. I'm gonna concentrate there for a second. Okay, I'm happy. But uh, I just thought that was kind of uh, interesting how that worked out. And Perfectress, nice. That's about all we can do here, I think. Damn. I always feel like I end those off faster than the the meter runs out, which means I could take my time there a little bit more and focus, but I like to do it fast, man, you know? But uh, yeah, it has been a, a good time here, and I think I should probably mention at some point soon, probably in the next stage, uh, I do plan on recording the next part in a couple weeks, so this will be the last time you see it for a minute. But let's go ahead and build up one more Tetris, and I will explain to you in greater detail what I mean by that. Nothing bad or anything. Welcome to the soothing sounds of Forest Dawn. This one is a pretty lovely stage in all honesty, even if I am kind of sucking it up at the moment, but it's very aesthetically pleasing and uh, I'm a big fan of it, so having to talk through it is a little disappointing, but any stage with, you know, rain and lightning, it's just, it's a good time. But like I was saying, uh, one of the reasons why we're going to take a quick break from this, you guys probably won't notice it, but uh, Sarah and I are actually going to celebrate our four-year wedding anniversary, which also happens to be the eight-year anniversary of when we started dating. So it's literally just the middle point of, you know, officially having been married for the same amount of time we've been dating, you know, so that's kind of cool. It's crazy it's already been so long, but... Let's go ahead and do this. I feel bad having to activate it so soon without path, but had to be done. Okay. Don't be getting your L and J's confused, Mr. Cruz. There we go. There we go. Uh, thank you. Nice. All right. We got this. We got this. Come on. There we go. Uh, uh, 
Okay, so we at least got the deck up. That's fine. I'm good with that. We can probably just burn off these other pieces. It would not hurt. But uh, yeah, we're actually going to Boston, which neither of us have been. So that's fun. Uh, you know, just going somewhere completely new to both of you while, you know, keeping it fairly domestic. We really didn't want to have to, <laughs> I guess, uh, cook with fish oil and try to leave the country. But I just thought it'd be fun, you know. And it's, it's, it's supposedly, like, really beautiful, so we'll see. I'll be the judge of that, you know. <laughs> All right, so back to the game. We're not doing too bad here, actually. I was expecting this area to be a little more dynamic, but that's all right. Let's just go ahead and uh, get some extra burns in there. I need some burn heal. And let me just warn you now, we are about ready to enter that stage I was telling you about. The one that gives me the heebie-jeebies. So without further ado, uh, let's get some extra points first because I might need it. This was a mistake, wasn't it? Oh, it was totally a mistake. Okay, we at least got a couple here. Damn it. Okay, I wanted that extra one, even if it was a triple, but... Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to welcome you to, of all things, Kaleidoscope. So, inherently, there's nothing really terribly spooky about this. Uh, I just think the sound effects and the- it's just- it's just weird. For some reason, it evokes some kind of, like, I don't even know how to respond. Like, like I'm having an existential crisis listening to this, you know? It almost feels like I'm epileptic, which I'm not. At least I don't think I am, but <laughs> Sarah and I were watching uh, Stranger Things the other day, the end of season one, when they're in the school and the lights are flashing constantly. I almost passed out because of how obnoxious they were, but it, it kind of feels like I'm sort of zoning out, no pun intended, just, I don't know, listening to these sounds. I don't know what they did, but they, it just, like, spooks me out, you know? So, I don't know. I might be in the minority there, but... It's, it's definitely a little bit more on the creepy side compared to some of the other songs. No vocals and purely electronic sounds. It's just nothing about this is natural, so... Let's go ahead and probably just get through it as quickly as we can. I probably should not have done that. I had a damn O block. There we go. Yeah, man. Ugh. I just... I want to get out of this. Please. Alright, let's do this. There we go. Okay. Ooh, I can do it. Ah, 17, man. Yeah, I don't know. Sarah and I are a little behind on Stranger Things, but I've just been sort of re-watching it leisurely. I've been hearing a lot of good things about the last season, and, uh, you know, I kind of fell off at the end of season two, so it hasn't really been on my radar as much lately, but that's right. Uh, but yeah, without further ado, we are almost out of here. So with that, let's do it. Here in, uh, I think this one is called Turtle, uh, Turtle Dreams, of all things. I'm, I don't, is it? Is this one Turtle Dreams? I hope I didn't write that down wrong. Oh, it totally is. Okay. Uh, a bit of a departure from what we just did. Not in a bad way, but, um, it definitely does kind of continue on the weirdly eerie side of things. But, I like it. Reminds me of, uh, Metal Gear Solid for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> don't ask me why things remind me of certain things. I don't know why I associate turtles or green imagery with that, but <laughs> do with that information what you will. Now, from here, I am screwing myself up, so we got a couple of burns to do here. 
There we go. And I wasn't going to talk about something else. Uh, just how much I'm going to probably suck this up. All right, let's go with the T-spin here. Not particularly hard to do, but... Um, another good way to increase your, uh, your zone gauge also. People will do that like crazy. Just the speed at which people will create their <laughs> T-spins. Just for those extra points, because they're worth a lot when you do them right. But that was not an official one, so it's fine. All right, got my second line. Let's go ahead and boom, activate. So, uh, got a third one in there. Can I get a fourth? Probably not. If I don't see a line coming up and I have to build for another Tetris near the top here, I will just skip it. Oh, no. What am I doing? No. Oh, no. All right, well, this is unfortunate. I have no idea why I did that. Okay. Let's uh, let's redo this. I really don't want to have to redo the last thing we just did. I don't want to play Kaleidoscope again if I can if I can help it. And I'm getting all the wrong pieces. Holy jeez. Okay. That was a bad idea too. Okay. Well, shoot. Um, I'm like half conflicted if I just want to build on top of this hole. I could probably do it, but ugh. I I hate my indecision. Why can't I concentrate? Is it because I'm talking? There we go. Dirty Tetris. Somehow, <laughs> I don't even know. If, I don't even know. Okay, this is bad. I don't know why I was trying to set up like a tuck there. I'm gonna have to get rid of that like immediately. Cause that's not gonna help. This we'll probably have to do. Let's do this. All right, all right. We can fix this. Watch this. Watch this. This will work. The double O's are good for that, and now we are set. Well. That was awful. Uh, shoot. <laughs> well, so much for that redemption factor, but here we are in uh, the greatest American pastime of all time, the stage simply known as Celebration. We've got fireworks, we've got a raucous round of applause, and we've also got fire and beer and brats, and it's great, especially when Texas is facing an honestly pretty terrible heat wave that is uh, probably going to be quite the fire hazard coming up here with the, <laughs> all the fireworks that people are sending off already uh it's awful so we are all ready for this nonsense let's uh set ourselves up for our zone here i am gonna try to get some extra points just squeeze out as much as we can i'm a little impressed we are almost at 100k here but we'll try that and i think we'll be okay thank you okay can i please get that l piece please We'll be fine. We'll be fine. There we go. Not going to get that other Tetris, though. Line comes just a little too late. Come on, come on. Ugh. Oh, no, no. All right, well, I'll just do this. Damn it. I just needed one extra space, man. Okay, so something that annoyed me about Spirit Canyon when I was playing that uh, was the fact that I had a half zone meter and I didn't use it at the end. That's something that I always forget to do because I just assume there's a new st a new level right after, but I'll make sure to use it here this time. Get some extra points. But... Yeah, everyone is real excited here. And if I'm not mistaken, I don't think there were any songs with vocals uh, in Area 4, so it's kind of interesting. All right, I think we're good. We can get a couple extra Tetrises here, so let's go ahead and set that up nicely. Get our points. Uh, maybe some better, yeah, there we go. That, double dependencies, name of the game. All right, come on, there you go. Uh, let's throw that in there. Okay, so we have one line to spare. <laughs> That'll end us off, so let's just go ahead. Come on, give me that line. All right. This is the real redemption factor right here, folks. Check it out. Oof. Come on. Come on. Ah, this damn controller, man. Okay. And now we can get yet another Tetris after. So long as I don't burn another line, but... 
Uh, looks like we'll be okay. So with that, come on, I said with that. Okay, I'll grab another one. That's fine. Get those sweet push down points. We are done. Honestly, I am amazed that we got an SS rank out of that. I was able to stay true to my 25k average per stage, but man, I am not doing <laughs> anybody any favors with this project. But join me next time as we take on Area 5 because uh, this one actually is not as bad as I think it is. Maybe I'm conflating with Area 6, but this will be in a couple uh, weeks, I guess. Uh, so I'll, maybe I'll practice on the Switch. Who knows? I actually play better on that than I do on Xbox, honestly, but gotta go for quality, otherwise people won't watch it. Anyways, take care, everybody, and I will maybe see you here. Who knows? Hopefully I don't die in the heat wave. <laughs> take care, and I'll talk to you guys later.